Hi, it's been a while since I've done my own video. I've been really focusing on talking to people who have some expertise in, you know, like Dr. Eleanor Greenberg. I also have a couple of other videos coming down the pike um, in other like modalities and things like that. But I've been asked something um, specifically about like, is it worthwhile to tell the person in your life whether they have a disorder or not, especially when it comes to narcissistic personality disorder. And I've been asked that a number of times. I've written about it on Quora and um, have been, you know, spoken about that. And the short version is no, 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 no. <laughs> the short version is not in your best interest to talk to someone who you are um, uh, suspect, know, believe has narcissistic personality disorder because they will uh, deny it. They will use it as a way to uh, crazy make and gaslight. Um, they will defend against it. Um, they will do all the things that their psyche uh, has uh, conditioned, been conditioned to do, which is to defend itself against attack. And if you are the one who's attacking it by saying that it has a problem, it will attack you. Um, have you ever tried telling an alcoholic that they're an alcoholic? Most of the time, nine times out of 10, they will say, no, you're the one with the problem. I drink because of you. And that's how narcissistic brains sort of think. They think in addict type thinking. Um, so they just deflect. Narcissism in particular is really challenging in having uh, themselves, like a narcissistic personality disorder is really, really challenged by self-reflection and seeing their own um, culpability, their own responsibility, their own behavior inside of things. So the short version is no, no. The longer conversation around it is If you're inside of a relationship with someone and you really want them to be different or fixed, and if they're behaving a certain way and their behavior is ongoing, uh, a little bit abusive, unkind, inconsiderate, um, uncaring, um, in a way that just has you feel badly about yourself and you're trying to get them to be the way they used to be when they were inside of their love bombing phase, leave leave. I've said this on another video before, but it's hopeless. Leave and pay attention to the part of yourself that feels addicted to having it go back and be different. Deal with that. Fix that. Address that. That's something you have control over. Another person and a person who's got narcissistic personality disorder, you have no control over them. Nothing. So, that's the long and the short version of that response. I hope that helps. And then stay tuned for the videos that I have with Dr. Eleanor Greenberg. I also have it with some other people. Thanks, I hope you're well.